Hi guys, this is Cobra Tom. And Venom Lily. And we are doing the Star Wars Power of the Force. Yak face, I have no idea. Silt. Murray? Sure. Salt Murray? <laughs> I don't know. With Battle Staff. <laughs> Professionally got this done. We got this from our um, local freak toys, local toy store freak toys. We got it for, I believe, eight dollars, seven ninety nine, something like that. Six dollars, six six dollars, six whole dollars. Oh, where's your game? In my room on my Xbox. Ah, okay. Wow, she's having difficulty. This will give you about forty five minutes to uh, find her game. For hey. you. <laughs> Do you think I could just like Okay, I think you're just going to have to rip it open <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to save the package because I thought it was cool But this has got a rip in it anyway I, so it's, it's okay, I got this She's got this She's got this, don't worry Totally Totally, 100% She's See, this has been reduced several times because it was at J.C. Penney's and then it was some else. And then Freak Toys. So clearly, this guy, and they're selling it for six dollars. So clearly, he's probably not, a very wanted character. Yes, he is probably the most wanted character who shows up for three seconds in a movie that everybody was just like, "There's the dude. He is my favorite character." There you go. Wow. You did actually excellent. You did really excellent. Excellent job saving the box. I'm just that good. She is. Call of Duty. Yep. She got this at Freak Toys too. It was Call of Duty. I had a $10 gift, gift card there and she had... I didn't get Call of Duty yesterday. I got GTA. Well, you got that too. <laughs> Where's that one? Is that one? Also on my Xbox. Oh, I didn't see it on the Xbox, but okay. Yes, the other day when we went there, I had a $10, or we bought this. And then when we bought this, she got a, I got a $10 thing, and we were able to get the figure. And she got this one. This one yesterday. Hmm. See, hers, her game was $11, but I had a $10 thing, so then I quickly decided. That, scary. Scary, yes. But GTA. But GTA. There we go. Here we go. We're going to just show really quickly what the back looks like of these old cards. They've got an actual picture from the movie, so you can see here, here he was. He was, this is about as long as he was probably in the movie. Mm -hmm. They probably scanned over the crowd, and there he was. Might, height, 2.2 meters. Status, informant. Classification, unknown. Loyal to Jabba the Hutt. Weapon of choice. Double barreled blaster pistol with modified trigger guard. Um, okay, so apparently his thing is a rifle and not a staff. Even though it says on the front. Oh, it says battle staff. There you go. Battle staff. Battle staff. And it does have this really nice... Well, she's trying to get the battle staff and... Uh, just untaped. Salt Marae untaped and un out of the figure package. I will show you the holographic thing on the card. That's cool. That's nice. That's kind of why I wanted to keep it. Please, okay. If you've seen Fraggle Rock, he he looks like the Outer Space Explorer. We will put a picture of the Outer Space Explorer in there in just a minute. Then we will discuss the figure really quick, Really quickly. Him. <laughs> Him. This is the Outer Space Explorer. And when we show you the figure up close, you'll see exactly what we mean. As you can see, in the same pose as the other picture. And yes, he is definitely the Fraggle Rock Outer Space Explorer. He even has the hair on the <laughs> Yes, yes. And compared to a normal three and three quarter inch figure, he is like ridiculously tall. 
I mean, he's like, well, not quite twice, but he's literally head and shoulders above the other guy. <laughs> Good head taller, at least. Well, he was cool. We were there, and I was like, I'm not going to just spend one dollar. You know, because mm -hmm. I had a $10 gift card, and she's like, why don't you get this guy? Because we were looking at Star Wars guys, and she's like, why don't you get this guy? This guy looks like the guy from Fraggle Rock, and we both laughed and had a good time. And I'm going to really quickly show you his staff gun blaster thing that, I don't know. It says battle staff on the front, and on the back, it's like some kind of gun. I don't know how he cannot possibly hold it like a gun. But I suppose he'd put his hand, like, sort of like this. <laughs> okay, he's really going to have to hold it like this. But if he wanted to shoot it like the gun, there's the... I'm sure here's, like, the trigger. Here's the eye thing that he looks through. Here's the barrel. It does look like a gun when you have it like this, but... Um, there's no way he can hold it like don't make fun of his weird hands. If he didn't have weird hands, yes, this would be perfect. Maybe I'm holding him wrong. Maybe he's got to be left-handed. Well, anyway. <laughs> Here, give it a try. I'll, I'll show you the cross cell. You can get Lando. I almost bought Lando, because I do like that Lando. I do like the helmet on that one. Bib Fortuna. Always been a fan of the Emperor. I like the Luke. Bosk is really nice. I did see the ship. Oh, don't, please don't wreck our... Oh, there you go. She's actually... Oh. Aww. Maybe if you held it in one hand and put it over the other. Held it in one... That's what I was trying to do. Yeah, that's what, that looked good. Uh, oh, and here's a, uh, here's a checklist. Check list. You can get Luke Skywalker, X-Wing. Darth Vader, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Obi-Wan, Yoda, Sand Trooper, Death Star Gunner. Death Star Gunner and Boba Fett would be two figures I would actually like. Uh, the Jawas, the 2-1-B uh, medical droid. That's that's a cool droid, actually. He's blue. He looks really, actually pretty cool. And the Emperor looks really nice. Then you can get the Snow Speeder and the Imperial Shuttle. Oh, Luke's T-16. Oops. Skyhopper. Oh, there we go. She's I got... I mean, she, kind of. It's she's on got the it verge looked. of falling. And he yeah. did. Well, she had it for a moment. It's really nice. This figure is really cool. He's going into Jabba's palace, and he's going to just hold his thing like this because it's... Uh, makes most practical sense. It makes the most practical sense. Except not really. Except not really. But yes, here's a character... Who's in the movie for three seconds on the battle barge, or sail barge, and he has zero lines. We know nothing about him. It even but he's says, cute. but he's cute, and that's all that matters. Well, thank you for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.